Hi guys, I made a video a while ago about installing Windows XP on a netbook via USB. So that's creating that Windows install USB flash drive which you can then bung into your netbook and install Windows XP. Now I'm going to show you pretty much the same thing but this is going to be a thousand times simpler and this will work with Windows XP, Windows Vista, Windows 7, Windows 2003 and also some uh, BART PE, the Windows pre-installation environments. You can also do that onto a USB flash drive. So first thing you need to make sure obviously you have a USB flash drive and also your source media such as a Windows DVD or Windows CD. As you can see here I have the Windows 7 64-bit operating system DVD. This is the RC version but it will work with the upcoming Windows 7 retail version. And I also have a big enough drive here. I, it's a 7.5 gig drive so that's enough to fit Windows 7 on so make sure you do have have enough space on your drive before you start. So the program is called Winter Flash and it is unbelievably simple to operate. So simply open up the program and then click this big green tick. Simply do that and it will say this program will help you install Windows from a flash. So this is actually in beta at the moment so there may be some spelling mistakes or some bugs in there somewhere. Uh, if there is, there is discussion forum which I'll show you in just a second. So here it says, where is your Windows files? So basically, what is my Windows drive? So as you can see up here, it's drive D. So it was correct, but I'm going to select it again and click OK. And it's now saying, what is your USB drive? So in this case, this is drive H. So I'm just going to select it, go to drive H, click OK and then go next. Now I need to sign the or accept the agreement to sign my life away. I accept, continue. It's going to format all the data on my USB drive. Click OK and that's all I've had to do. That's it. <laughs> so this works again with Windows XP, uh, Windows Vista, Windows 2003, the upcoming Windows 7 and it's as simple as that. If you go into the advanced mode, uh, which I, I won't cancel this, but if you go into the advanced mode you'll find it has about four options. Uh, you can change things like what sort of USB you want it to be, like a USB HDD, and you can also ch change the format type, I believe. But there's not really that much point. You might as well just go through the really easy setup here. Now, instead of coming to me and asking me if you have any problems, they do have, if you go to the Winter Flash site, which again I'll include in the description, they do have a discussion forum. So you might as well go straight to the people who wrote the program uh, rather than coming to me for anything uh, because I'll probably send you there anyway. So it's best to come here, have a look. As you can see, there's a problem here that's been solved in the latest version. And again, this is 0.4 beta, but as they say, you can use Windows 2008, Windows 7 from CD or DVD to USB in some mouse clicks which you just saw. And my uh, DVD drive is now spinning away and it's copying my files. So once this is done I can just keep the USB in the computer, set my BIOS to boot from the USB which I'm afraid I can't show you because obviously I can't screen capture this. But if you go to the boot menu you'll find that you should be able to boot from the USB. Uh, you may need to Google that for more information. But that's pretty much it. It's a very easy way to install a, uh, or to create a USB drive that can install all these different versions of Windows in just a few mouse clicks. So that is Win2 Flash. I'll provide again the download link in the description. Feel free to check it out. If you, uh, <coughs> excuse me, if you have any problems, go ahead and go to the forum or report here if there's any major problems. But thanks for watching my video. Please comment, rate, subscribe if you like my videos, and thanks again.